both Sweat and Kerrigan on the sideline for this third down. Third and four. Jackson keeps it himself up the middle. He's got room. Lamar Jackson. Open field. Inside the 20. He is in. Lamar. Spectacular. Touchdown, Baltimore. A 50-yard run by Lamar Jackson. His longest of the season, the left guard, Bradley Bozeman. But when you commit to the line of scrimmage, the minute you crease it and get five yards down the field, he's beyond the defenders. I know we talk about Devin. Well, he's looking to come off the edge again here on third and 11. Screen to Gibson. Gibson's got some room. He's got great speed, too. Cutbacks by Gibson. Inside the 20 and smacked down at the 12 by Jimmy Smith. Antonio Gibson providing a spark, a 40-yard gain. Slow down. Don't try and cut the defenders. Keep your feet, run through the defenders so that they have to dodge you. And that time, a great job reading your block, setting them up. So Gibson, yeah, we, we talked about his wide receiver skills. A lot of those... Kill Burrow and Minshew Mania, that's a wild one. Dalvin Cook, he's going to get a first down. And Dalvin Cook pushes his way toward the end zone and they're going to spot him well are they going to give him credit for the touchdown it is a touchdown they're going to rule it a touchdown will take a close look looked like he stayed in as he was headed out of bounds but what a effort to work through the tackles greg you said to me during break dalvin's unbelievable pressing that hole and exploding and that's exactly what he just Panthers up 14-7. Play action. Bridgewater wide open. It's Bonifon for the touchdown. It's lack of communication. New safeties. No talk. It's going to sneak out right here. Now, everybody's talking here, right? But we can't let a man run free. We're in man coverage. So, right there, Curtis Riley, do your job. So if you have man coverage, that takes precedent over everything. So remember what got Second down and goal. Nixon out of the backfield. Has some daylight. Hurdles to the end zone. In for the score, and he took a lick from Miles Jack, but he hung on. Touchdown, Cincinnati. Burrow this year. Good play design. They have A.J. Green lined up over there. He runs an inside route, clears it out for Mixon, who does the rest, gets it in the end zone. Waiting. It's up. From the 25 on first down, Stafford looking, can't find anyone. And now he fires downfield, and the catch is made by the tight end, Jesse James. Out of nowhere, looked like Malcolm Jenkins was going to get the interception. Wow, that, that's Moss. That's been Moss right there. Jesse James going up over the top. One timeout left for Seattle, first down. Little pressure on Wilson, and Wilson on the run. Long pass, and it's caught by Moore. David Moore with the catch. Wide open was Moore. No, and this is your worst nightmare if you're Brian Flores. You just got momentum. You got the field goal, making it a 10-9 ball game. Which Joe Burrow said is awesome for a rookie to have an open-minded coach. Mixon, speaking of openings, inside the 15, the 10, the 5, inside the pylon, touchdown Cincinnati. 34 yards for Joe Mixon. He not only has his first receiving touchdown of the season, now he's got his first rushing touchdown. He's, he's got to come up here and seal, and he gets caught going inside again, and you're not going to catch Mixon. The question is if they bring yeah. pressure, they're going to get, we're going to play coverage. Right. They bring pressure, and the pass is going to be knocked away, incomplete. And let's see, it was picked off. Xavier Howard got the ball, picked it off. Getting as many weeks. Diving in front of Metcalf for the pick. Big stop. Gronk still yet to find the end zone for the Buccaneers. Had seven targets last week. Brady. Oh, perfectly thrown to O.J. Howard. Touchdown, Buccaneers. 24-21. The Buccaneers are battling back at home against the Chargers. Tom Brady, three touchdowns on the day. Herbert is hit on his last seven passes. Fake the handoff. Downfield. Oh, great hands. Keenan Allen. Aqu
acrobatic play for a first down. Watch the route by Allen. It's an out and up, and then come back to it. And Carlton Davis is in, he's in great position. How does he not get that football? And that's what he's going to be asked in Phil. That's what he's asking himself right now. He could not have played that better. And Keenan Allen goes up, catches it, gets both feet down. What a tremendous play. They are not going to give him the first. Baylor played Kyler Murray in Oklahoma. Kyler Murray had 432 pass yards, six touchdowns, and no interceptions. Now Murray, for the first time today, really getting off and getting running. Murray, looking for a little bit of daylight, finds it, and then slides down. But Kyler Murray down to the 27. That's a 49-yard scramble. But it never fails, right? We talked about the key was bringing five to take away six rushing lanes. That time they only brought four to take away six rushing lanes. Kyler Murray had a choice of two running lanes, and we see we should here to do a game. You get one <laughs> volunteer mention. If that's your mention for the day, we'll move Is on. Is that it? Is that all? Brady, home run ball on the way, and it's hauled in. Scotty Miller over the shoulder for the Buccaneers. That this Chargers secondary is pressing up on them. So you need some speed, and they get it here with Scotty Miller. You've got to have somebody run deep to make them respect you. And you remember the ball Herbert threw in the first half that was so perfectly thrown for the touchdown to Tyron Johnson? Tom Brady says, I see you, kid. And I'll 12 seconds left in the third. Stack the receivers. Herbert a deep drop. Off his back foot. Puts it out there. It's caught. And he's gone. Jalen Guyton to the house. Touchdown. Chargers. 72 yards. Everyone. All those white shirts. And now you're in man-to-man -man coverage. No safety in the middle. Guyton wins off the line of scrimmage. And Murphy Bunning can't make the tackle. But how about Justin Herbert in the pocket with all of that coming in his face and delivering accurately downfield? Last year at Oregon versus the Blitz, 11 touchdown passes. And Miami trying to make defensive changes quickly. And Russell Wilson going for the end zone. And the pass is caught for the touchdown. And a flag is down as well. Penalty marker down. David Moore who made the big catch before halftime to set up a score for Seattle. What Tempo will do, and typically this Seattle Seahawks offense wants to rush to the football to try to see if they can either catch you changing personnel or catch you sleeping. In this case, look at the concentration by David Moore, elevating to catch the football, but then getting two feet in bounds and completing the process of the catch as he goes to the ground. And Myers in the Super Bowl, and now re-signed with Washington. First and ten. Askins looking deep for McLaurin. Has a step, and McLaurin with the catch. Good looking play there by Washington. A gain of 39. A little bit of a confidence booster, not only for Dwayne Haskins, but for the entire Washington football team. You get a turnover late in the game. You continue to play to fight. Yeah, I know we may go back and look at Formation here for Seattle. To the edge. There's the deception and another touchdown. It's Gerald Everett. That's ah, just like I said. Here it goes. Gerald Everett, the tight end on the jet sweep, and you're showing dive. You're essentially just really coming downhill with the running game. Then you hit him with something quick going off to the outside and go ahead get your old line involved right those big hawks